Good morning, everybody. So, this is just a little talk and just what's on my thoughts lately with all the people that comment on my channel and other people's channels. Most of you guys really are sub 300 pound bench pressers and you complain that somebody has an arch and whatnot. Oh. I've already shown my straight leg, straight back Larson press was 315 pounds and 325 pounds. At the end of my workout, after I benched over 365, well, I did 365 and I almost got to 375, but I used a wider grip, so wasn't used to that. And I did multiple sets of 350, 340 for two, 335 for two, just over 300 pounds. And I showed my Larson press. And junky steroid monkeys. And you know who you are. Said I couldn't even do 295 with a pause. <laughs> Fuck. You probably think you motivated me to do something I could already do, right? I'm going to do my arms again right now, too. I'm going to make sure it's straight. Oh, I got a little bit more than last time. Nineteen and a quarter. That's for straight arm. Let's see if I do it on an angle. What can I get on an angle? Which is the biggest part of the arm anyway. So we'll go right here. It's a little bit of an angle right there. Actually, it's not even much of an angle at all, is it? What does that say? Oh, 19 and 3 quarters. So that's dry. So I almost got 20 inch guns right now. And that's without even doing much. Because I usually wait a week before I do my biceps again. And they're still sore from my last workout. It's a little bit. Because I do a lot of work with my biceps. So let's see your bench press with a straight back and straight legs out and actually bring the bar down past the fucking bench. Okay? Let's see that. You never show nothing. You know who I'm talking about. Soft man, rock man, the fucking steroid fucking junkie. Okay? Because that's all you are. You need fucking steroids to do any fucking lift. Fuck, man. Fucking such an idiot. And if you can't comment on my channel, it's because I don't fucking like you and I don't even want to fucking see you. I don't put up with fucking stupidity anymore. From anybody, and I don't give a fucking shit if you block me or whatever, because I don't even go on your fucking channels anyway. There's only a few people I go on. And rivalry with me and Batman is fine, it's just for fun anyway, because I like the guy. He lives just right over the right over the fucking strait of Georgia for me. He lives in a nice city, which I'm gonna go to eventually. And we're probably going to have a good workout together. We'll do bench press. And I'll, I'll fucking help him get fucking past 315 that day. Trust me. He'll be able to do it right with me helping him. Just for me standing there. He'll see me do it. And he's got the fucking energy just to do it. Because it's in him. 
Okay, and that's for certain guys like old school strength. Buddy, who the fuck are you, buddy? You have no strength. You have no fucking 350 pound plus bench press. So don't even go there. He goes, well, I'm not a power lifter or a bodybuilder. <laughs> fuck, you couldn't even do it if you tried. You, I don't want to see you on my fucking channel either. Fuck. Profit fear, you think you're stronger than me? Mm, okay. But the weight I bench, let's see you do it, would kill you. If you're stronger than me, you should be able to bench more than me. You should be able to overhead press more than me, which you can't. You should be able to curl more than me, which you can't. I showed your bench press this morning anyway. I know you saw that one. And if you can't comment on my channel, that's why. Cause I don't fucking like you, okay? I don't give a fucking shit. I don't care about all your sock accounts either. Or anything. Zephus, you are on steroids, okay? It shows everyone that competes has done steroids or is on fucking steroids. Just because you passed their fucking little piss test doesn't mean anything. They got so many fucking other drugs that you can fucking mask it or get rid of it, right? Once a junkie, always a fucking junkie. Like, don't even go there. I seen your video today with all your scars and all that. I'm not going to put people down for hurting themselves. It's called derma mania or something like that where you... uh Cut yourself and pick your skin, right? Usually it's all the drugs that do that to people. I've seen it. And it's good you got yourself off the drugs. Those drugs anyway. But you use another drug to replace the drug that you're using. Just weightlifting itself gives you a nice euphoria, right? It's a good feeling just without drugs. You don't need the steroids to do this. You should get off the steroids. Humble yourself and start back. Boom, boom, boom. Right at 225 again, okay? Enough with this fucking 350 pound benches, 340 for two with the guy spotting you. And this guy behind you look like he's going to fucking hump you and stuff. Like, come on. Man. And you should work your arms too as well. Because you can't even do pull-ups, man. I see the way you do pull-ups. You're like, ah! fucking jerking it up, man. Like, what the fuck is that? Just put your legs straight and do a fucking pull-up. I know you don't have any arm strength. But you have to start and get it. That's the problem. You people cannot humble yourselves to do that. You have to take the drugs. And I just don't understand why. Y'all know who you're talking about, too. Y'all know who I'm talking about. All you people on steroids. You really don't phase me at all. If you're on steroids, it means you're fake to me. Okay, I don't care if you're fucking Larry Wheels or fucking Thor. The fucking... You're all fucking steroid junkies, okay? And those guys just use more than you guys. Okay? Get it? That's all they do. They use tons of fucking steroids, man. Even Jason Blaha. That guy's fucking on steroids, too. He's got some good info, but... He uses steroids. You can see how his bench goes up and down. Fuck, man. People fucking... It's, it pisses me off to be compared to people on fucking steroids. This is fake. Okay? Natural is the strongest. There's no comparison. You can't compare yourselves to me. Alright? Because you guys will never bench press over 365 natural. And I've got over 405. I have witnesses. Man. Like my brother. Fucking many friends where I'm from. Alright? Even on video, my friend Preacher said I'd, he's, he's seen four plates. Okay? And he's seen more than that actually from me. But he remember four plates. 
And he don't lie either. That guy's done many years in prison. Places that you wouldn't even want to fucking be. Any of you. Alright? You guys think you're all fucking tough and all that? Fuck, man. I've been places too where you don't want to be. Alright? And he's been places where I don't want to be. Alright? He's not going to lie. Same with my brother. He don't lie either. I get a lot of hate in the gym, too. I already know. People, just because they're jealous, because they know that I'm fucking natural and I'm 48 years old, and they will never, ever be like me. Even in their 30s, they will never be like me. And especially at 48, most of you guys are done. All right, you got guys like uh, Alan, sober powerlifting, but he's fit over 50. He's over 350 pounds, and he can bench press 400. So it's like... People doing 50 pounds more than their body weight, which is strong, obviously, at 400 pounds. But he's on steroids, too. Like, don't even fucking lie about shit, man. Just be honest with stuff. You're not natural. You guys are not natural. Just because you pass those drug tests doesn't mean anything. You guys are all on fucking steroids. Could be pills, which are bad for your fucking liver over time. Or you guys are needling fucking needling shit in your bodies like fucking dirty junkies within fucking needle and you're dependent on the fucking street drugs and you're dependent on pharma companies all right you're depending on the pharma companies and the doctors you guys are dependent on drugs just like you people that drink alcohol too much you're dependent on alcohol you smoke weed you're dependent on weed anything any kind of drug you guys do you're dependent on it I used to smoke weed too, and I stopped, because I'm fucking sick of it. Fucking all this fucking shit comes out of my fucking lungs. Fucking pathetic. Like I want to fucking have that shit. Even eating it. Like, what's well, like, uh, fucking not move and feel vulnerable to people? I don't like making myself vulnerable to anything. Fuck. Rockman, let's see your, and I'll go on your channel and look, okay? I don't even have to comment because I don't even give a fuck. Let's see your flat backed, straight out Larson press, okay? If you're so much stronger than me, you should be able to do it no fucking problem with no sleeves, all right? No fucking elbow wraps or nothing. You can't do it, especially without drugs, okay? Any of you. That I said they're on drugs, you can't do it. Just like Dr. Rackpole, he was on steroids before, man, or TRT. They get them over in England easy, man. And that's... Uh, fuck, man. That's why he doesn't even lift anymore, because he has nothing. He has nothing. Oh, I'm benching 220 now, oh, fucking six times. What the fuck does that mean? It means you're fucking weak now, motherfucker. Maybe you should fucking... Hit the gym more than you hit the bike and all your stupid videos, man, with fucking fighting. You haven't even put up a fight, man. Put up a fight. Let's see it. Let's all see your fight. You don't even do it. Fuck. Just fucking smoking mirrors, everybody. All show. Fucking no go. All you people. Just like Steve Shaw, same shit, man. I, I know my bench is over 400. Fuck off. You know it's not. That's why you don't show it. You don't even answer it or nothing. He's probably going to block me anyway. Fuck. Fucking have a good day, guys. I'm going to the fucking gym. Smash like if you like this one. It was, I just say it the way it is. And I really don't give a flying fuck about any of you and what you think. Unless you're honest, you come clean and say you're on steroids, then I will respect you. But other than that, I don't respect anybody that lies and acts like they're fucking natural when you're not. And I don't think any of you guys in your 30s are going to be benching what I am when I'm in 
when you're 48 like me. It's pretty well impossible to do that. And all of you know it. Peace. Good luck to you all.